To thrive in the energy transition, we will need innovation and new technology. TerraPower's Natrium Reactor is one of the only truly advanced domestic reactors under development today. The Natrium Nuclear Plant is being demonstrated in Wyoming through a partnership with TerraPower and the U.S. Department of Energy. A truly advanced reactor, the Natrium technology brings decades of experience into a simple, small, and flexible package. The plant is designed with a nuclear island and an energy storage island. It all begins on the nuclear island. In the plant's reactor building, advanced uranium fuel is inserted into an enclosed container and covered with liquid sodium. A chain reaction starts when uranium atoms split and release neutrons and heat the metal coolant inside the reactor system. The Natrium reactor uses liquid sodium metal to cover the plant's core and transfer heat for power production, unlike existing reactors that use water as a primary coolant. Sodium's boiling point is eight times higher than water, significantly enhancing the Natrium plant's safety. The liquid sodium is heated and then transfers thermal energy to pipes filled with molten salt. This radiation-free heated molten salt then travels to a very large storage tank that serves as a thermal battery for the plant. This is an important feature of the natrium facility. The nuclear and energy islands are separate, limiting the radiation footprint and simplifying construction. The molten salt passes near water-filled tubes and boils the water to make superheated steam. This pressurized steam then helps turn a turbine, creating electricity. Operators can release more or less molten salt from the storage tank increasing and decreasing the power output to the grid. With its heat released, the molten salt is transferred to a cold tank and eventually back to the nuclear island to begin its journey once more. With the Natrium technology, TerraPower is building the energy grid of tomorrow, today. Electric utilities are increasingly adding renewable energy to the grid. Power sources like wind and sun fluctuate based on the weather. The Natrium power plant can compensate for low periods of renewable power by ramping up and scaling back power output based on demand. The Natrium reactor will begin operations this decade, bringing dispatchable, carbon-free energy plus gigawatt-level energy storage, the flexible power generation utilities need to reality. To find out more, visit www.natriumpower.com.